Many years ago, I made a video on this topic of IRA. Today I am going to make the same video, but here I will talk about a problem that you faced and asked me about in the previous video. Now this is our cash flow, here this uh, minus figure is our initial investment and we have three cash inflows. So, as you know that IRR is a rate at which our net present value is equal to zero, so we can write the equation like this line. So, we put it into our calculator. For x, we'll press this alpha, then this closing brackets. For equal sign, we will press this alpha, then this button, not this equal sign. So, alpha, then this button. So, press shift, then solve, and equal sign. See, we have our result. Our IRR is 15.5315%. So, if we calculate in, it in uh, Excel, we have the same result so this is how you can uh, calculate your IRR using the scientific calculator but now some of you may ask me that will I be able to solve more than three years or five years or six years all right uh, like this one well let's try to solve it and see what happened. So, if we try to put this equation as usually, then we will face some problem and uh, I will show you in a mi minute what is the problem we face. See, this icon became bold. Here it was not bold, but after putting one more characters, it became bold. That means we have already used 99 characters. We can use few more characters. So, let's see what happens. So this calculator is not allowing us to to put any more characters. So this is the main problem. We cannot solve this problem because of our limitation of characters. The fact of the matter is this calculator cannot calculate more than 99 characters at a time. These characters include digits, sign, brackets, decimal point, etc. So I don't have any 
direct solution to this problem but I can uh, suggest you some tips so that you can solve this problem here I will write 25 instead of 2500 I will reduce to 0 and and in case of this number 2864 I will put a decimal point here after 8 and so that I can reduce to zeros and instead of this bracket 1 plus x bracket I will write only one point remember here I will put a point then x so it will save two characters point as I have reduced to zero one of x minus plus eight and I have reduced to zero so I I have to put a decimal here oh sorry I have done a mistake here write only 18 and 1 point x to the power 4 plus 18 and minus I have to write 70 it became bold so it means I have already used 90 characters so I have to be careful now then 0 so take shift and take small equation See, we have our result, but we have a 1 before this point. In previous example, we did not have this 1. We di directly got our result, but here we got 1.22. It happened because we wrote uh, 1.x instead of 1 plus x. So, when we consider this result, we will reduce or deduct 1 from this result so we will get our exact result here our result is 0.22097 or 22 percent so if we calculate in it in excel you can see see our result is 22.0976 percent exact ex exact equal to this result so this is how you can um, solve this problem of long equation now i will show you another approach to solve this problem so first we have to clear our memory so shift then this nine we will just clear our memory so press two and equal sign in this technique we will save all the values except this variable so 2500 we will save it to this a so this shift store and a it has been saved to a 
then 2864 2D 2836 2C and 1800 into D again 1800 into E and seven thousand yes so check your value we call a twenty five thousand hundred we call b we call c we call d b so now we'll write the equation simply as we have this value in a so we'll write alpha then this a then one plus x you can also write one point x at that case you will get result with one but if you really have very very long equation then you can write one point x otherwise you can write 1 plus x both will give you the correct result but if you write x point 1 then you will uh, get a result with 1 <coughs> plus alpha p x alpha c sorry I have to put a square here then plus alpha t sorry plus Ah, sorry. sorry. It should be X. Yes. Alpha x plus alpha e. I think so. Oh, sorry, I'm doing mistake again and again. One plus x to the power five minus f alpha equal zero we have used 90 character this bold uh, bold icon is indicating this so but we have already finished so the sheet solves a equal to 2500 yes correct b equal to 2864 yes correct just press equal sign just press equal sign x equal to 0 don't write anything just press equal sign so you have your result 22 uh, 0.22097657767 so if you convert it into percentage it will be 22% so this is how you can solve this problem of long equation using using your calculator memory and i think it will help you and thank you for your patience